speak militarily but also full of symbolism. So the fear is that this could trigger a very strong Russian response. We saw yesterday uh, that a residential area of the city of Zaporizhia, a major city in the south of the country, very close to the front lines, uh, was hit. Uh, more than a dozen. So. This is an NBC News special report. Here is Melissa Rayburger. We have breaking news at this hour. A This message is transmitted at the request of the United States government. All stations shall broadcast this request. Please stay tuned for further instructions. This is a national emergency. Important instructions will follow. This is not a test. The United States Department of Defense has issued an attack warning for the United States. The North American Aerospace Defense Command has detected eight long-range nuclear missiles en route to the United States. These missiles have been confirmed to be originating from Russia. Areas of target are Los Angeles, California, Washington, D.C., Chicago, Illinois, New York City, New York, Cincinnati, Ohio, Las Vegas, Nevada. Seattle, Washington, and Jacksonville, Florida. The United States and NATO have taken countermeasures and have launched a total of 30 long-range nuclear missiles to Russia. These missiles will destroy Russia's remaining artillery and will disable them from taking any further actions on the United States or NATO members. Please pay close attention to these next steps, as your life may depend on it. If you are within a 300-mile radius of any of these cities, it is vital that you find a fallout shelter, or seek shelter underground as soon as possible. These missiles will arrive to all listed cities in the United States within 15 minutes. Do not go outside. Have a battery-powered radio or two-way radio on hand for communications. Assume that cellular connectivity will be unusable. Action items, make sure there is a minimum food and water supply of 14 days. If you do not have at least a 14-day supply of water, Fill up as many sealable containers as possible with water. Alternatively, fill up your bathtub with water for consumption during this time period. Remember, do not go outside. Radiation levels will be lethal and will lead to certain death. Stay tuned to this channel for further updates. The President of the United States is currently being transported to a secure location and will address the nation within the hour. Please tune to AM channel 800 or FM channel 88.7 in case this station is taken offline during impact. Please stay tuned for a message from the Federal Emergency Management Agency regarding nuclear attacks. A nuclear explosion produces dust-like radioactive material that travels through the air and falls to the ground. Protecting yourself from high levels of radiation after a nuclear explosion can save your life. Follow these simple steps to reduce your risks from radiation. First, quickly get inside a solid, secure building. Go to the basement of a multi-story building or the center of a single-story structure. Plan to stay inside for 12 to 24 hours or until you are told by emergency officials that it is safe for you to leave. Stay tuned to TV, radio, or the Internet for updates from authorities. Get inside. Stay inside. Stay tuned. To protect yourself and help others.